Let's deploy any code using AWS Lambda and Stackpack in less than 3 minutes without needing the AWS console. We have a Python function called Lambda Handler that pulls channel data from YouTube and will pass the channel name as the parameter here. You can check out the full code on my GitHub repo, the link is in the description. Now comes the cool part. We'll use Stackpack to generate the infrastructure as code, and we'll run this command to create the Lambda function with Python, expose the function as a URL to make GET requests without an API gateway, put the code in zip format with the data block, and add a layer for the requests package. The importance of a layer in our case is that we're using a third-party package, which is the requests package because we're using the YouTube API. Just download the package in a folder and zip it. And now we've got the code ready, so let's accept the code here and make sure everything's configured properly and change any variables if needed. So I've got this here. I'll need to change index to YouTube, which is the name of my file, and the function to Lambda Handler. And again here I want the zip to be in YouTube and the file is youtube.py and control S to save the change. Now this is our Lambda function resource. And the package has been installed in a python.zip file so I'll change that as well. Now I do notice that the Lambda function is missing the layer so I'll make a modify request to add the layer to the Lambda function and check the modified code. Now the last two blocks are not needed because we already have them so we can delete that and accept the modified code. And the lambda function has been updated. Now let's click here and submit a pull request to sync to our GitHub repo and then go to our GitHub repo and merge the pull request. And done. Now time to deploy everything. We go to our CMD and Terraform init to initialize Terraform. Then we'll do Terraform plan. And if we look at our files after that, we're going to find the YouTube.zip just like that. I didn't create that. And finally, let's do Terraform apply to create our resources and apply the change. If you got any errors in this stage, recheck your variables in the Terraform code and change them. And voila, the deployment is complete, we'll have the URL put in the channel name which is stackpack and we've got the channel data extracted. So it's that simple, that's how you deploy any code using AWS Lambda and stackpack in less than 3 minutes. If this helped you, like, subscribe and try stackpack. See you next time!